Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? Welcome back to some more FIFA 20 career mode here today on the channel. We're back on our Barcelona Ultimate Difficulty Realism Modded Career. This is Season 1, Episode 4. In today's episode, we've made it all the way to the UEFA Champions League semi-finals against, funnily enough, Jurgen Klopp's Liverpool. So if you like the sound of that, feel free to leave the video a like. Subscribe if you're new right here with notifications on. Let me know in the comments, feedback and suggestions for the series thus far. If you don't like me, you don't like Barcelona, you don't like FIFA for whatever reason, feel free to leave a dislike. I don't care. That's what the button is there for. So here today we have two legs in the away for Champions League. Obviously against Liverpool. Home and away. We've also wrapped up La Liga by now. So... Now with the title all but surely sealed, we can focus on the Champions League. It's going to be a tough proposition. We host them first. Let's get stuck into them on Ultimate Difficulty on Fiverr's Realism Mod. Okay, guys, welcome to Match Day. We host them at the Camp Nou. So I, I kind of like going away first because I don't like inviting on pressure. So we are playing on Ultimate Difficulty. We're playing on Fiverr's Realism Mod. You only can play this... If you have PC, I'll put in the description below if you guys would like to download it and play along with me. Adds a lot of added difficulty. It adds sort of um, better quality AI to transfers. For example, like Real Madrid went outside Pjanic, um, Bruno Fernandes. Atletico managed to go out and sign Milik and a fair few others. Oh, and as you can see here, Liverpool have gone out and splashed the cash on Ruben Neves, the former Wolves man. Alrighty. So they've got Allison and goal. Trent Alexander-Arnold Gomez, no Martip. They're not playing Roberts. They're playing Milner at left back. Okay, there's a lot of stuff we can isolate there. We can hunt down James Milner on the left. And we can go after the weaker partnership of Gomez and Virgil van Dijk. Salah's been sent through here. PK, you got to collect that. PK's been burned. Oh, it's Mo Salah, man. You give the AI an inch of a chance. Gerard PK has completely fluffed that one up. And unfortunately, Mo Salah has skipped away at the Camp Nou. A good cutback. And boom. A magnificent goal, a blinder, what a finish there by Mo Salah to score his sixth goal of the season. Oh, Bernardo Silva comes flying in to clatter James Milner. Griezmann takes a touch, but Virgil van Dijk clears. Wijnaldum to Fabinho. A nice pull over the top. Mane at the edge of the area, beats one, nearly gets tackled there, stays on his feet, it's Firmino! Oh, but fortunately enough for me, it's gone offside, we've got such a fraudulent back line at the moment, Griezmann on the left here now, looking to bring someone in, Bernardo Silva, looking to cut back, Arthur's been caught there, back to Griezmann, Griezmann, to Neymar, goes for goal, and it's a good block by Virgil, come on man, for fuck's sake, we're getting played off by Liverpool, I fucking hate Liverpool, Mane, to make it 2-0, straight at the feet of Ter Sagan. If there's one side in world football I can't stand, it's going to be this Liverpool squad, I love Jurgen Klopp, but everyone is the starting 11, I just don't like it. Oh my god, Arthur, they're trying to curl it. It also doesn't help that there's such an amazing squad on FIFA. Like, Firmino is probably the only inconsistent one. The rest are phenomenal. That should have gone in. That's nuts. 1-0 down here. Um, my team is exhausted. We're just getting... We're just, the thing is, right... I, I like to actually, ironically, play like a high-octane-inspired Gagan press. I like to press. I like to close down the opposition. But because we're playing as Barca, we're actually playing a possession base. We're trying to hold possession, and Liverpool are just taking it off us and then hunting us down big time. Suarez against his former side. Goes for goal. It's gone over the bar, man. It should be at least 1-1. Messi trying to find a head of a Catalan faithful. Messi whips it into the box. Rocket hitch rises to the occasion, but it wasn't to be. 
Will we get dumped out of the semi-finals in the UEFA Champions League like last season against Bar oh, against Liverpool? And Longley has given away a penalty in the 80th. Everything has turned into an absolute fucking shambles. It's Mo Salah with a cheeky chip. Can't get his brace, thank God. The gods aren't smiling upon him today. Mo Salah with the chip in the 82nd there. It's a good diving save from Ter Stegen to keep it to 1-0 down. But the problem is, because we're in the UEFA Champions League semi-finals... Oh, that's set to pen! Ah, oh, my name. They've got that away goal. That's what the problem is. De Jong coming fresh off the bench now. Replacing Arthur Rakitic. Can't quite get to it. Allison's been clattered there, but he's been caught. And Rakitic has given away a foul on him. But that's it. The full-time whistle has blown. We've lost here today. Our biggest upset of the season. 1-0 against Liverpool. We should have got something more than that. Man, oh man, the pressure is on here today. We go to Anfield. Juventus and Spurs are in the... Um, what was I going to say? They're, they're, they're in the other fixture. So it could be a Liverpool and Spurs Champions League final. What? Sorry, Spurs, yeah, could be if they win. Yeah, could be another one. Or it could be a Barcelona-Juventus or Spurs final. Man, imagine if Poch, or I guess Jose Mourinho in this timeline, gets to the final again and, like, loses. <laughs> Regardless, unfortunately, Ricardo Pereira has picked up an injury, so we're going to have to bring on Roberto instead. So, let's get stuck into Liverpool, away at Anfield. Man, oh man, it's so hard for any side to get anything at Anfield because they close down the VAR machines. I know, it's a conspiracy. I find it quite funny. But I wouldn't be surprised when they played Manchester City that it wasn't working that day. Wasn't that the conspiracy or the rumour? But uh, overall, I don't think there's a VAR conspiracy with Liverpool. <laughs> I think it's just a little bit too much. Right, so have they changed their squad somewhat? Oh my god. Okay, so they've actually strengthened. They brought on Martip and Robertson for the second leg. Firmino. God, we just can't concede. Because we have to score three. Because <laughs> their away goal is crucial. Good defending. Looking a lot more solid in the first 20 than last time. Arnold, Neves, Firmino. Having ne Neves with his passing range... The former Wolverhampton Wanderer man. This is another quality midfielder for Liverpool. And the Scousers are through! <sighs> oh my days. I think that's it. She's all over Red Rover. Barcelona have thrown the toys out the pram. I was talking shit about Firmino earlier on. It is currently 2 0 on aggregate. Roberto Firmino has started the scoring here. And have we been dumped out of the Champions League? Busquets, Bernardo, Griezmann on the 28th. He has to score here, and he does. It's Griezmann to bring it back to 1-1, and we've scored early enough here. He's absolutely delighted with that goal. What a finish. He just jumps into the crowd. That sensational inch perfect to drive it and curl it around Allison, Mane, Fabino. Robertson, look at him go. Come on, PK. You can't stuff this one up. For Shakira. <laughs> All right, let's counter-attack. Bernardo. You can see the run of Messi there. Virgil's holding him well, but Neymar split the difference. Got to score here. Neymar brings it back to 2-1 and 2-2 on aggregate. We have the two away goals. That's enough for now to go through. We have two away goals. It's still on. The match is still on, boys. Neymar and Griezmann have come up clutch. Man, oh man, I, I seriously threw the toys out the pram so early on. But we found a second wind, you could say. A newfound confidence. And Frankie de Jong's on the break here. Straight at Allison, nearly lost his footing. Naby Keita comes on now. 
who drew the penalty in the last match. It's Scrappy. Um, what is it? It's a penalty! It's gone to VAR, and VAR has given a handball to Barca. 90 is my best penalty kick taker. Neymar gets a penalty to make it 3-1 for the match. Neymar, the home fans are on him. He's going to hit it to the left. Neymar misses the penalty. Oh, my God. You're going to give me a heart attack, Neymar. Griezmann from the corner kick. We could have made it 3-1. PK and Robertson, the Scotsman, calmly thumps it out. Name, uh, Mane, rather. Mane, 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 Firmino, Mane scores. Awesome. It's a fucking joke, man. What is with this AIDS Liverpool squad on ultimate difficulty? It's time to make some substitutions. We need to change things up. Suarez, Dembele. I've been praising Suarez's finishing this season. Hopefully he can come on and score. Oh my god. Liverpool still on the attack. This is so close. Firmino. We can't let another one Keita. Close this down. Shut this shit down. Yes. Go. Go you motherfuckers. Go. Rakitic looking for the run of Suarez. Suarez splits the difference. He beats Martip. It's Louis fucking Suarez. Yes. Louis Suarez brings it back to 3-3 three. Three on aggregate just before the 76. Fuck yes. He scored against his former side. I'm delighted with that. That's spectacular. What a strike. A stick of dynamite. It's game set match. Has he clinched it towards the end there? A stunning goal. It's snatch and grab in the dying embers. But that's it. The full-time whistle has blown. A Luis Suarez goal has booked us into the UEFA Champions League final. I'm over the moon. I don't believe it. After two heroic, classic legs in the Champions League. That's what I love about football. That's what football is all about. Oh, my God. Barcelona win on away goals. 3-3. Get in. If that doesn't deserve a like, I don't know what does. Or maybe a dislike. Fuck it. Why not? Unfortunately, guys, it is time to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you're not enjoying the series, feel free to leave a dislike. Check out my social media links if you want to stay connected with me. Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, all in the description below. Highly recommend Twitter. Every single time I post a video, a tweet goes out. It's much more reliable than the YouTube sub box these days to get all the notifications for the channel. You have to click subscribe, of course, and the bell to join the notification squad. I do enjoy reading those comments. If you guys want to get yourself some cheap and reliable games maybe some PSN and Xbox codes to buy packs for Ultimate Team or maybe just some games I really do recommend checking out my affiliation link G2A there's some really good prices so even just going looking around to be honest anyway uh, the Patreon Stinger there as well come and join the community on Steam my name has been CMC stay tuned for more videos on the channel make sure to take care of yourselves have a fantastic rest of your day my name has been CMC goodbye Mares whips it into the box Royce that is just ridiculous with the layup Marco Royce